welcome everyone welcome 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 i want to say happy birthday this is the solar energy vibration welcome to a new month and this is going to be the solar year reading for you pisces who are having birthdays um this is going to be good okay the energy of uh, um the week is here so I see a lot of you Pisces are going to be dealing with a lot of issue in this year, okay? So whenever it is a year that is coming up with situation issues and that sort of a thing, I see a lot of you are going to be creating and clearing up situations that you have been dealing with, okay? So it is wonderful. It is really going to be a wonderful year because it's as if there is time now where you're going to be coming in and resolving issues and situation that was basically holding you back for the last couple of years so hmm, very very good wonderful energies that is um going to be coming through so be a re ready and aligned with the energies um for this year so when we look at the solar year, what is happening and what is transpiring with a solar year is that a solar year is from one birthday to the other. And what is going to be transpiring is that you need to ask for a birthday reading because as you ask for a birthday reading, you get um, so many in information that helps you month by month to deal with issues and situation. And we are changing up all the energies that is going on. However, this is transpiring. We're changing up all the energies that is going on. And whenever you fall in a week, like this week, that is the energy of here. What is happening and what is um, transpiring is that it affects you for your old solar year from this year until the coming year. From this year until the coming year. So this is a very good and a, a very wonderful because um, what is happening and transpiring is that you are going to be clearing up the issues and situation. This reading is for the birthday solar year from the 2nd of March until the 8th of March. From the 2nd of March until the 8th of March. So wonderful, wonderful energies. Happy birthdays to everyone that is coming in. What I need you to understand about a solar year reading, a solar year reading, um, whatever affects, whatever comes up in this month is going to affect you for the entire. So let's look and see what is coming out for you guys, the star. So whoever is born on the 2nd of March, this is the energy vibration of the star. This is wonderful. It's a positive alignment of energies. Um, then we have the energy of the tower for the people who were born on the 3rd of March. So you're clearing up issues and situation. Then we have the energy of the hermit. This is a good energy um, because if you're a spiritual, if you're a psychic, you will use that energy to create financial abundance. Then we have another angel energy, which is balance that is coming in for you guys. So I see um, clearing of things. It's a year of healing for you guys. Victory and success. And this is coming out for the people who were born at the second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth. Okay, so for the people who were born on the 6th, I see the energy of the chariot. The people who were born on the 7th, business people, I see you might be creating a new business. People who were born on the 8th, I see the energy of uh, the eye princess. Wonderful energy vibration that is coming up for you guys. And you have the energy of the magician. Um, the same energy that is coming up for this week, um, and also the same energy, you Pisces are going to be very, very successful in this year. It is as if some of you Pisces have been going through issues and situation, and now what you're doing is creating and clearing up a situation that is going to be transpiring. So, um... Um, what I'm going to be doing is that uh, you're going to be having 
dual energies and I want you to remember um, the cards that you choose because it's going to be creating a lot of stability new a new start is coming in for you guys okay have big dreams and be very playful in this year so I have four energies for you guys and uh, the energies that I um, that came up for you guys in this year is going to be the wise woman of the Northland and the wise woman of the Lord Northland is coming up with a number 21 so you have 21 and 23 that you're going to be working with 21 is 3 23 is 5 so there is going to be transition but there is going to be abundance that is going to be coming up for you guys so this is going to be beautiful um the woman of uh, the wise woman is integrity it's all about integrity okay so it's all about integrity and by having integrity you're going to start dreaming big and you're going to be having these big dreams okay and these dreams are definitely going to be manifesting in this month this year whenever it is uh, associated with you so um the wise woman i always call her the grandmother the um the, the you know the spiritual woman that comes up to help you once you vibrate with integrity she will comes up it's like your grandmother that is going to speak to you about certain things then we have let go of small thoughts about yourself see yourself successing and see yourself succeeding and what is happening and transpiring pisces this is a beautiful message for you guys okay and a wonderful message because what is transpiring is that you need to start dreaming big Pisces. No matter what is happening, you need to start really, really dreaming big. You need to understand that this is a year that you're going to be creating a new start for yourself. And you're definitely, definitely is going to be creating um, a big new start in your world. Then we have duality, which is beautiful. And we have the dragon dual. We have inner conflicts. A lot of you are dealing with some inner conflicts that um, you're going to be leaving behind. However, this is transpiring. These inner conflicts that you're dealing with, you're going to be leaving behind. Morality and consciousness choices is what is going to be transpiring for some of you also. So it is wonderful. Um, it is good. It is going to be a time of playfulness listen to the dolphins go and visit the dolphins know the importance that you need to also play and enjoy your life as you play you can manifest and create the miracles create the things that you want to have and the things that you want to associate with so this year is going to be a year of a play time however this is coming up and this is transpiring this is going to be creating a lot of opportunities and a lot of time that you are going to be using to create financial stability in your world and this is going to be good so this year is looking absolutely wonderful it's about your fairy godmothers are going to be coming in for you pisces and trust me each and every person have a fairy godmother and what is transpiring with a duality and the woman um the wise woman from northland is that they are going to be helping you so this is um because you are ruled by neptune and you're governed by neptune what is going to be happening and transpiring is that these energies are going to be coming in and opening up doors of opportunities for you guys so this is looking as a beautiful year and not only that but you're going to start dreaming big you're going to start letting go of the small thought and your ego telling you that you can't do certain things and you're going to start dreaming big a big message for you pisces is that you need to open up yourself and balance out um the yin and yang balance out uh, the negative polarities of who you are okay and that is going to be good all right let's get in your birthday so you have the energy of the magician it is an air energies i see wonderful positive energies and remember you are if you begin with the energy of the star 
say you were born on the 2nd of uh, um, March, then you're going to have a tower moment. Then you're going to see the truth of a situation. Then you are going to learn to balance out the, the situations. Then you are going to be learning to move forward. Some of you, I see new cars is coming up. Some of you are going to be buying new houses. I see some of you are going to be leaving issues and situations that no longer serve you behind. So I love this. I really love this. It's um, it's, it's a clear cut year that you guys are, are going to receive the ends of the gods and goddesses to help you guys to move forward. Okay. So we're calling up and um, pure light beings. They're like, we're here. <laughs> and the energy of the Pisces to come in and show the Pisces who were born March 2nd until uh, March 8th, what is going to be coming up. Happy birthdays to you guys. So, all right. So first we're going to, um, I'm going to lay the cards out and then I'm going to explain um, to you guys what is going to be coming up there is the energy of success with the wheel of fortune this is beautiful for the people who were born on the third then we see you ladies going within and if you ladies are psychic you're going to be making a lot of money um, by using your psychic vision you're going to be making a lot of money a lot of you are going to see your enemies and trying to balance out your enemies for the people who are born on the fifth people who are born on the sixth i see um money coming in you're going to be buying a car you're also going to be receiving a child okay so your wife could be pregnant or you could be pregnant I see people uh, who has business. Your business is going to be a huge success. I see a lot of offers is coming in. Um, people who are born on the 8th, I see um, that some of you are going to be buying a house. Some of you could be getting married and buying a house. I see a lot of parties and everything. I see you guys, your wishes and dreams are going to be coming in. I see some of you are going to be receiving um, new love that is coming in. For, from a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn I see a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man is going to be sending you a lot of love okay a lot of love some of you ladies could be meeting this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person now the wonderful thing about this energy is that what we're seeing here is that we see that you are magically going to be having a new start so some of you could be starting a new business. However, this is transpiring. I see wonderful new start is going to be coming up because some of you are going to be starting a business. Some of you are going to be starting new creations. Uh, some of you are going to be opening up doors um, for yourself. And some of your doors are just going to be automatically opening up new opportunities, a new part. You're going to be moving forward at the next birthday you're going to be oh my god th that was really a good reading i see exactly um what she was saying okay um remember in order um in order to have uh, a personalized reading you can always uh, connect using the link below remember to um join it's just a dollar ninety nine, and you receive all the extended reading dollar ninety nine. And remember to subscribe and set your notification buttons on. I love you, Pisces. Let's go look and see what your solar year is about to bring for you guys. Now, what I'm seeing here and the extra message that came out is that a new start with a new love is going to be coming in. A new start with a new love okay so um, some of you Pisces a new love is going to be coming in your life some of you Pisces are going to be moving in with someone um, some of you Pisces if, if there was um, heartaches and that sort of a thing I see a new love coming in your life and this is absolutely beautiful absolutely wonderful I'm trying to get it out of the light okay after um, so is is really going to be a positive year for you too and that is an extra message so i see the universe is offering you pisces love okay love 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 is coming in the universe is definitely offering you guys a lot of love 
it's giving you new starts in relationship it is opening up a lot of doors um, I see new houses going to be buy I see more money you guys are going to be making a lot of money um, um, some of you are going to be divorcing if you're um, married to an Aquarius I see you divorcing whatever legal issues you guys have it's going to be good okay and whoever you are as a woman that is a psychic you're going to be making money like you have never made it before so right so money is coming in um, for some of you who had a legal issue um, there is money coming in for the people who had a legal issue I see some jealousy and some of you have to protect your kids because I see um, some jealousy I see some secrets that is going to be coming out okay I see changes I see um, blocks blocks um, with a business for some of you but this blocks is going to be lifted up and let me ask them what is this cloud some of you who have business there is a cloud over your business what is this um, cloud with the business okay Ooh, oh I love uh, emotional issues and uh, all right so some of you I see a cloud but we're going to um, success I see a lot of successes twice um, the energy of the Sun that came in for you guys all right so let me oh, let me go in the reading I see some jealousy some of you have a business and there is some some jealousy okay so be aware of that so for the people who were born oh I'm trying to get the light for the people who were born on the 2nd of March this is beautiful this is absolutely beautiful I see if you were dealing in a relationship or a lawsuit um, okay so if you're divorcing an Aquarius Gemini or Libran you're trying to protect your money from this person um, and this is going to be good I see you're protecting your money so Pisces who are in a relationship with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra I see you're put, protecting your money from this person whatever the issues that you were having with this person I see that this is going to be resolved when the energy of uh, the star comes up it's all about healing it's all about things it's all about healing things in your life and this is going to be absolutely fabulous in this year because I see you're going to be cutting out the BS and you're going to be moving forward and at the same time you're protecting yourself so some of you could be standing up for yourself you're standing up for yourself you're going to be ready and standing up for yourself it's like this year is going to teach you to stand up for yourself and understand who you are and is you are going to be creating wonderful abundance in your life because you are going to be realizing that I am standing up and I am going to be protecting myself and create my own abundance listen ready there is the money a lot of money is going to be coming out for you um, you um, Pisces especially for the people who were born on the 2nd of March a lot of money is going to be coming out so be aware of this spicy so if you were someone that was worried about money in however way and you were born on the 2nd of March listen you are about to create abundancy in this year okay so from your birthday until your next birthday expect to create a lot of financial abundancy if you also have a legal issue and a lawsuit you're going to be winning a lot of money so wow enjoy let's move on to the people who are born on the second another beautiful energy is for the people who are born on the second I see um, a tower moment okay this year is going to be a lot of changes for the people who are born on the third whoever was born on the third there's a tower moment so I see a lot of stuff is going to be removed out of your life but what is going to and a lot of changes for you people who are born on the third but what is going to be happening is that you're going to be successful at anything you have the Sun and the wheel of fortune so something is going to leave your life in this year a huge tower moment but this huge tower moment is taking away things and situation that no longer serve you now it is replacing your life with a wheel of fortune that is bringing in changes and this is bringing in success 
but also changes that you weren't you would not have dreamed of so this is going to be a powerful wonderful year especially for the people who were born on um, the 3rd of March because it's as if your life is about to change your life is going to be having a huge transformation and trust me anything you want in this year buy a new house furniture move um, go on looks vacation trust me it is going to be your year you have the Sun and the wheel of fortune this is extreme luck for you people that was born on the 3rd of March as we look at the 4th of March, I see you ladies, um, you ladies who are psychic, I see um, you are going to be making a lot of money. Okay, so if you are psychic or you use um, the psychic, um, you your, 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 your readings are going to be so clear cut. A so clear cut Pisces, and this is why I said Pisces, Cancers, and Capricorns. Aquarians and Virgos are the best readers because you see through the veil of illusions. Ladies, your year, whether you're a man or a woman, whether without psychic or you are just an intuition person, your intuition is going to be helping you to create a lot of financial abundance. So your intuition is it's going to be opening so much and giving you these creative ideas so if you're a creative person you are going to create um, your life in such a way that you become a multimillionaire if you choose to do that okay because I see a lot of you are going to be creating new business a lot of you if you work from home a lot of you if you have your own business you're going to be um, having so much money you're going to be buying a huge house you're going to be opening up new businesses whatever is happening this year for you Pisces even though it looks so dull it is absolutely a brilliant year a huge house new business new corporation you're going to be creating this okay um, some of you are going to be buying I see new house new apartments but yet still you're creating you could be buying a whole apartment complex um, because your intuition is right on track buy a lot um, try and win the lottery because you guys the luck is here and this is how the luck comes up a lot of money is going to be coming in for you guys so there's definitely um, a business that is coming up a huge business um, this business is going to be opening up and you guys could be opening up a new business but definitely I see a lot of you buying new houses the people who were born on the fourth as we look at the people who were born on the six I see you're trying to balance out things because it's as if it's clear now who have been working against you okay so it's a year that you're going to be seeing the people and situation who have been working against you it's as if some of you have been stuttering blocking this that and every time something comes up and all of a sudden you see the people that was working against you and because you see them you are making changes in your life because you see these people who was working against you and because your eyes is now open you are creating a lot of different changes and through that you're going to be learning how to keep your enemies off and this is a good year to do that so it depends on whoever um, you are and your birth dates and the year that you were born that has a lot to do with you because I see also success is going to come out for you I see the energy of the Sun and success is going to be there for you so there is a lot of positive um, um, things that is coming your way and especially when you know who your enemies are that is the best time that you can protect yourself and create more abundance because then you know to protect yourself but whenever we're going through and we have no idea who these people and situation is you're going you you have no idea how to control a situation and I see that you're going to be finding out the people that has been creating illusions and blocking your world and you're going to be healing that situation 
as we move and look at the people who were born on the 6th, you have been um, having some jealous people around you. There is years, years, years. You got to learn in this year to protect your kids, protect your car, and protect your money. Whatever is transpiring in this year, it's about protecting your kids, your car, and money. There is jealousy all around. So if you were born on the 6th of March, there has been so much jealousy that has been affecting your life. You need to realize the jealousy that is happening. A lot of you are going to be moving and relocating. A lot of you are going to be having um, like these high profile jobs is going to be coming up. A lot of you are going to be buying a new car. A lot of you are going to be getting pregnant. A lot of you who were having issues getting pregnant, um, this is going to be over. A lot of you are going to be um, as, as if whatever, if you're in a business, a work, a job, or creating your own financial stability, a new start is going to be coming in. You're going to be moving so fast and swift forward. It is as if the blockages are up. It's as if that tower moment come in and move and you're moving so fast ahead. And because you're moving so fast ahead, some of you are creating a lot of jealousy around you. So, um, some of you, um, you're going to be relocating. I see you will have the money. I see a new car is coming in for some of you. Um, some of you, a new child is going to be born. I see a lot of you who were trying to have a kid. I see, um, this is going to be a lucky year for you guys. Some of you men are de dealing with a jealous, deceptive um, woman. This could be an ex-wife or so. You got to be careful of this woman because there is so jealous, so much jealousy that this woman has for you. But I see you're moving away. You could be leaving this person. I'm not seeing a divorce. It doesn't have to be someone you were loving with. But whoever this person is, this person is um, either going to be created in the time span between now and your birthday. But I see the lies and this woman is very, very horrible. Some of you ladies, be careful of your girlfriends. Um, and I see some of you ladies, if you are sharing a place with a girlfriend, I see you're going to be moving. And I see you're going to be moving away from this person because you realize how deceptive this person is. Okay. You realize how deceptive this person is. What I should say, there is a lot of new love is going to be coming in. And uh, what is going to be transpiring, a lot of you are going to be emotionally... Um, mm, very emotion. Um, relationships. I see some of you, um, relationships, new love is coming up. But... There was a block, especially um, we're going to be looking now at the people who are born on the 7th of March. If you have a business, it's going to be good. I'm seeing new clients coming in. I'm seeing new people finding your business. I am seeing your business is going to be good. But the problem is that we have some clouds and I see that someone blocked your business okay someone tried to create some block to your business okay and i need to look at this because for you people who are born on the seventh what you have is that you have the power within you to become that leader okay and to create that business that you want and i see your wishes and dream is going to be coming out whether with work or business or in your love life Okay, you're in your love life. A lot of you are going to be meeting um, people in high position. And I see the love is so powerful. Um, some of you, um, people in high position is going to be helping you because they saw that um, it's like your business or at work, you were a block. And I see people in high position because here's your wishes and dreams. I see people who in management function is going to be climbing the ladder and I see people are going to be appreciating you. People who have business, I see your business is going to be a success. This is a, a success, the nine of cups. And I see you're going to be having a lot of clients that is coming in. So it's a very powerful year for you guys, but you need to 
um, look at this message and I'm going to see what is this cloud it has to be with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and uh, these two ladies uh, have and is going to try to block your business maybe you find out in this year or you're going to be realizing that these two ladies and Aries and Aries woman and uh, Pisces cancer and you ladies this is the woman who could be blocking you from work business and I um, paid function jobs this is an Aries lady okay Aries Leo or Sagittarius so be aware of this so whoever out there that is having a business there could be a cancer or a scorpion okay yes it's a scorpion scorpion so you um ladies and gentlemen if you have a business or if you are in power i see people in power is seeing the lies and deceptiveness that is going to come out about these two ladies okay because this energy is the energy of uh, um a block that was on your um it's like they created a block if you're a manager they created a block um if it's you it's an aries leo or a sagittarius but if um it is you women it is a cancer or a um scorpion a cancer or a scorpion i've created some blocks uh, um so that you you know like you don't get i have professional jobs and that sort of a thing these two people are very nasty and very deceptive but i see um in this uh, um period they're going to be it's as if the universe is going to have a tower moment to move them out of your life so um you people that was born on the seventh it's a beautiful beautiful year um, a year of new love, a year of uh, um, your wishes and dreams coming through about uh, um, a business or um, g getting the promotion that you have always wanted, buying the, the dream car, buying that dream house. I see that you're moving forward, but it's as if the love, the, 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 the grail of love is here. I see a lot of you are going to be meeting your twin flame and soulmate especially for the people who were born on the 7th of march i see the energy of meeting your twin flame and soulmate okay now we're looking at the people who are born on um the um 11th uh the 8th of march i see um there is uh, um some information i information and wisdom if you're studying you're going to be um finishing your study um with some high points i see some of you are going to be um marrying a taurus Virgo or a capricorn man um maybe this man you have seen you have known this man for quite some time i see a marriage and you're marrying this man because there are some secrets that you need this man to hold and in order for this man to hold your secret i see you're marrying this person i see that this man could be in some trouble some problem so ladies you know don't be um you know this is a good day the 8th of march uh ladies i you know i've known someone uh, this man have a secret some of you are going to be meeting a taurus Virgo, or capricorn man or have been uh, or have known this man for quite some time and you're going to be marrying this man but only because this man has some secrets so be aware um what you're doing because you're only marrying this man because this man has some secrets uh, either for you or in order that this man doesn't get in legal issue you're going to be marrying this man so it is a choice that you need to make um but i see some of you are going to be moving in a brand new house i see a lot of celebration so a lot of marriages you people who were born under eight, a lot of marriages is going to be happening. And I see th th there is, some of you could be building a new or moving up the ladder in a new corporation, institutes, and new jobs is going to be coming in. But what I see here is that the Storis Virgo Capricorn person could be your soulmate or twin flame. This person could really be your soulmate and twin flame. 
um, be aware of this man for the people who are born on the eight. This man has some secrets. Maybe you're not aware of this man's secrets, but this man has some secrets. So be aware. Whatever the um, whatever else this year for you guys, there's two time, and it's as if success is 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 standing. Um, you know, success is uh, the energy, and especially you women are going to be absolutely successful. Okay you women are going to be extremely successful but not only that that is coming up for you guys is that uh, yeah extreme success is coming up for you ladies but i see love coming in for both men and women i see an emotional um um message is going to be coming in it's as if someone from the past is going to be returning in your lives and this is like for all of you guys because all of the energies in this week at some moment maybe every three months your life change and you're going to be affected by all of this energy so if you if, if you were born on the eighth I see marriages I see you moving in a house I see you building a new house um, with a man I see you buying a new house with a man but this man has a lot of secrets that you're not aware of so for the people who were born under age, you got to be careful because there's an investigation that is happening to this man that you're about to marry. There is money that is going to be coming in and some of you are going to either change a house or build a house together with this man. Okay. Women, you're going to be extremely successful. There is it. Um, and especially women that are in high professional job, you're going to be very successful. I see um, you guys are going to be meeting your twin flame and soulmate. I see a lot of love um, that is coming in for you, Pisces, okay? And I see people are loving your business because this came out with um, some of you at work, people are loving it. Some of you who are in different sort of business, people are loving you. But on the work floor, you got to be careful for a scorpion and a cancer woman and an Aries Leo or Sagittarius they're not showing up who they are you got to be aware of these people because uh, there is some deceptive uh, or there will be but you're going to be catching it on time because you're going to be listening to your intuition so ladies and gentlemen please remember join the channel subscribe and turn your notification button on i love you guys leave a message about this reading and don't forget you have to check out the weekly readings also um this is the birthday readings and this is uh, for the people who were born march 2nd um to the 8th of march i love you guys leave a message namaste